When I was young, I loved to go rock hopping through the icy mountain streams. And we would hop from stone to stone, balancing ourselves. And sometimes the stone would shift underneath our feet and we would have to reach out to try to balance ourselves. Sometimes the stone would shift so much and move and we would actually fall into the water. But the goal was always to reach that one sturdy, steady rock that would not move underneath our feet. And in a way, my life has been a rock hopping adventure. I've lived in 17 different countries, 19 different cities. I've hopped over a lot of rocks. And one of those is my friendships. I love my friends. And every time I would move, I would have to say goodbye to these friends, often knowing that I would never see them again. And I would mourn those friendships as I would move to a new country and try to fit in with another group of ladies. The church has always been vital in my life because I knew that I moved so much and I would move again soon. As soon as I got to a new country, I would just jump headfirst into ministry and serving the Lord. So when we found out we had to leave again, um, I would always leave a, a bit of my heart with those people as I invested so much of my time into them. My children are also very important to me and being a mom has been very important and that role also is changing as I'm soon to be an empty nester and I'm not the number one person in my kid's life anymore. So if I were to describe God to you right now, I would say that God is my rock. As I travel through life balancing things, He's the one sure, steady, unmoving Thing upon which I can stand. The Hebrew word for God is sur, which is defined as God's consistency, His strength, His power, and His presence. And God is my consistency. He's the one sure, solid factor in my life. He has proved Himself faithful time and time in the past, and I know that He'll prove Himself faithful again in the future. God is my strength. Sometimes when I feel like I just can't go on, life is just too hard. It's his strength that grabs me and holds me up and helps my feet to stand firm. When my daughter and my father both got diagnosed with cancer in the same year, it was God's strength that helped me go on. Sometimes when the pressures and the stress of life are just too much for me, it's God's strength that helps me get up in the morning. God is also my power. When I try to stand up to Satan's attacks, I inevitably fail and I sin. And it's only through God's power that I can stand firm. And God's presence um, is always in my life. He's my constant companion. And so as I travel through life, um, hopping from stone to stone, I, I have to say that, that God is my rock. He's the one sure, solid factor in my life, whether I'm standing firm, whether I'm trying to hold my balance, or whether I'm just plain holding on for dear life. He's my rock. And so I say along with the psalmist, you alone are my rock. You are my fortress. You are my salvation. I will never be forsaken.